Hi there folks, welcome, welcome to this short and sweet video which is going to be super duper impactful. Yes, you heard me right. This video is like chota packet bada dhamaka because here I am going to reveal the sure short practical way to get 180 plus marks in your upcoming J Main 2023 exam. Yes, I am going to share with you the secret formula which will guarantee your success in J. Now this formula has two parts attached to it. The first part is, are you ready? PYQs, yes, previous year questions people. This is true gold. It is one of the most important and highly relevant resource to upgrade the level of your preparation. Now you may wonder why. See, because the bank of previous year questions is huge. The variety of questions is crazy and the quality of questions is simply beautiful. So if you wish to revise a particular topic or a chapter, well, where you should go? You should straight away go to PYQs. If you've spent a lot of time with the theory of a concept and you want to learn how the concept gets applied in the questions, that means you have to practice questions based upon that concept, again, go to PYQs. If you don't have much time left and you still want to prepare a subtopic or a chapter, well, the best way to prepare that topic is through, again, PYQs. So, are you understanding? Be it revision, be it practice, be it preparing a topic in less time, be it mastering a certain concept, everything has the ultimate answer as PYQs. Okay, now what should be your game plan? What should be your action plan to approach PYQs? See, you have to solve at least last three to five years J main papers and this is a must. Now when I say solve, I don't mean just anyhow solve the questions to get the answer. No. I want you to sit with each question, to in detail scan it, do its post-mortem, understand the concept, the result, the idea it is based upon and learn about the most efficient way to attack it and to reach its answer. This is the only way and the perfect way to make the most of the available PYQs. Now, when you're done solving the PYQs once, I would strongly recommend you to revisit them again, multiple times, twice or maybe even thrice. Study them again, solve them again, because that is the only way to ensure that they are strongly absorbed in your head, in your system. So now you people have nicely understood that PYQs is the go-to option if you want to increase your chances of acing the JE exam. But that's not all. PYQs is just the first half of the secret formula. What is the second half? Well, after you've spent enough time with the PYQs, you have to follow it up with mock tests. Yes, people, you heard me right, because this is what will add that cherry on the cake. This is what will give your preparation that final finishing touch and make it just perfect. How, you may be wondering, so let me answer that question. See, when you solve PYQs, what happens? They expose you to the diverse variety of questions that can be asked in the paper. They also show you the most repeated concepts or results. And you also get to know the high weightage topics, which are all time J favorites. So accordingly, you have the liberty to study smart, to focus on quality syllabus completion and not quantity. Right? But that's just half the job done. When you additionally regularly solve mock tests, what happens? It teaches you time management. You are able to excel at balancing between speed and accuracy. Isn't it? You are able to create a personalized, a personalized exam taking strategy for yourself. And you also learn how to control temperament issues. 
got it so this perfect combo of pyqs and mock test is what will ensure that you will 100% get success in j you will 100% ace j so people what is the moral of the story that the perfect combination of pyqs and mock tests is what will guarantee that you ace j you kill j you smash j so the secret formula is pyqs plus mock tests is equal to success this is the formula you should live by you should swear by if you want the best outcome of all your inputs on this note it's me bhumika signing off we'll see you super soon again till then take care and keep learning